How's it going everyone? It's Sam. I want to give you a very short rundown about why you need to buy altcoins now and not push this off, wait for money to trickle from Bitcoin to Ethereum to some of these other altcoins. Now that's been what's happened in the past, but I want to give you a little bit of a warning. Now I'm going to try to keep this really short and to the point. I'm going to keep it under eight minutes. So if you guys don't mind hitting the like button, the subscribe button, so that way I know you like these short videos. I really do appreciate that. Also, there are links underneath the video in case you want to get an interest rate on your crypto. So typically what happens in crypto, what we've learned in the past is money flows into Bitcoin, then it flows into Ethereum, maybe some of the other top protocols and projects, and then it flows into all the other altcoins. Now that's still very likely to happen. That's still mostly, most likely going to happen, right? When people have been investing in Bitcoin and they want to take some of their profits and make a better gain, maybe they think Bitcoin's already topped out. Let's say it's at 130,000, 200,000. Then they slowly start to pour it into some of these other altcoins. However, if you're trying to beat the curve, right? If you want to get in early enough, then you try to do that too. You try to put some of your money into these other altcoins before everyone else funnels their money into these other altcoins. Now, that is where we have to be careful, right? If we just go and say, hey, I'm gonna invest all my money in Bitcoin, I wanna move it over to Cardano though in a couple months, once we see Bitcoin at 200,000, of course, a rising tide raises all ships, but we have to be careful because some of these cryptos are running. Everyone else is thinking the same thing, that they would love to be able to ride Bitcoin and then ride Ethereum and all these other alts, and they're going to try to move it a little bit sooner than, than the rest of the people. But you have to realize that over the last 30 days, yes, Bitcoin's moved up 36%, but some of these other altcoins have moved up pretty close to that. I mean, Polkadot up 31%, Solana up 31%, BNB, which is not like a sexy crypto by any means for most people, 26%, Ethereum 30%. Bitcoin, 36%. And you have to be careful because even though these are lagging, right? They're lagging by a couple percent. You have to realize that that could change very quickly. Like you won't have enough time. If someone starts making big buys in Polkadot, it's such a small market cap at $42 billion versus 1.15 trillion. It's gonna move quickly. If you don't see it within minutes, it could move up to $50. $60, especially when we know some big events are happening, like the parachain auctions. Yes, dominance might go up a couple percentage, but if you are really trying to get into some of these other altcoins, it makes sense maybe not to risk it all. Now, of course, I am not putting all my money into Bitcoin. I'm not putting all my money into altcoins. I'm spreading it around, but I want to hold on to these for a while. So I am not just buying all alts at this point, I am trying to ride the Bitcoin train. Just be careful. If you are trying to jump from one to the next to the next, everyone wants to do that. Everyone wants a 2X in Bitcoin and then have Ethereum go up 20% in that time and then move it over to Ethereum, then 2X there, and then move it to something else. Just be careful with everyone thinking that we will see a bleed, I think, in some of these other altcoins. And while we still will see institutions piling money into Bitcoin and Ethereum first, you have to realize a lot of the people that have been in the space want to buy some of these top altcoins because there isn't a lot of risk compared to some of these smaller alts. And most likely they will bleed. They will continue to go up. That we will get pumps where we get 30% in a couple hours. I mean, it's bound to happen. So just be careful if you're looking to get into alts and you still think that crypto is gonna do really well over the coming months, now might be the time because it might be too late if you wait too long. So thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. Thank you for hitting the like button, subscribe button. Just a word of caution in case you are waiting to get into some of these alts. They can move very quickly because they are not large like Bitcoin and Ethereum. Thank you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.